of Lithuania. And for the U.S. starting five, once again, it'll be the same. Irving, Curry, Harden, Fareed, and Davis, who we know have taken advantage. A lot of offensive rebounding should be interesting today against the bigs of Lithuania. Yeah, that'll be a good, tough, feisty matchup. Of course, one of the things for Lithuania, playing without their point guard, Montes. Tonight's semifinalist, Team USA, is one win away from getting to the gold medal game and for two wins away from making it back-to-back -back FIBA World Championship four years ago and World Cups. It was also four years ago in Turkey that they beat Lithuania, always tight against this nation. Yeah, you see the numbers there. Now, Team USA in this tournament, plus 30 scoring margin. Fronting, getting the steal. Down court on the run, Curry. Not there, but weak side put back for Anthony Davis. One of the things Coach Cates made himself into a good playmaker. That's good transition right there. Great feed, and Fareed will burly. Nice block by Davis going up against Valanchunas, who wanted a foul. Pull-up jumper from Curry off the window and in. He, you know, something more than a dribble and a pull-up. Like that. Offensive tip, Fareed. This year on a loaded club. He's won two straight titles in Greece. Thompson lining up for three. He has been so huge. Now on Fareed. And Fareed has two. So two yep. for Curry, Fareed, and Harden here. And you see Clay Thompson's numbers, which have been steady throughout, even better lately. But if you'd have told Coach K 45 minutes ago that three of his starters would have two fouls oh, each. Nice cut right there. Oh, better pass. Yep. They would have had something. Instead, Irving pulls up for three, and they needed that. He's had a great... The Glass and Cousins has the board. Let's see what Team USA's got going on offense now, because right now, see those green jerseys all in the lane. They got Clay Thompson. Got That's the... Rose pushing one up. Draws contact. All language, too, that Co <laughs> Coach K has perfected uh, internationally. Lithuania has seven of its 16 at the line. That's a nice move inside. Oh, that. Nice job by Fareed to stay with it. You know, both ways now, both ways. Good enough to get to the rim. Over the top to Fareed, saving out to Curry. And Steph Curry knocks down. Thompson with eight points in the first quarter. We'll get the roll, make it 10 for Clay Thompson. Second time he's gone to his left and finished at the rim. Team USA wanted to establish a fast tempo in this game, and they haven't really been able to to this point. There's Thompson off the steal. 12 points for Clay Thompson. The United but if you're Coach Kozlowskis, you love this pace. Fareed, great move down the lane, the spin and the slam. Now the follow jam. Clay Thompson, Thompson averaging hits. 12 points a game off the bench for Mike Krzyzewski and Franny. has got 14 today. And look at the 6 for 11 on another evening when the U.S. shooting has been a little bit below par. Uh, he's come outside shooter. Cousins against Valanchunas. Switches to the right hand. Nice move. Rose finding a seam and missing for three. Nice rebound. Cousins. Not there. Tip in. Foul. Will they count the basket? That's a great effort by DeMarcus Cousins to keep that ball alive. Count the basket for the U.S. and a chance at a three-point play. Watch Cousins on this. Well, you saw the tail end. Oh, he's got three fouls for Lithuania. Three-point play for Rudy Gay. And now some pushing. DeMarcus Cousins and Jonas Valanciunas. They were former teammates. Watch the elbow. You Hear see that. Cousins almost lost it. Watch that elbow right to the Adams apple. Oh, look at that driving the left elbow through. Yep. To you the know point what? that Valanciunas, I think, expected to get popped. He... He Look kind at of well, it was ducked caught. away. Yeah, as what now right there. So inbound to the United States with 45 seconds to go in the half. Irving spins, fades, fires, gets Man. the roll. Tough shot, got it to go. 
They'll get another possession back. They went two for one right there. Well, Lithuania has a lot of depth like Team USA, and they can afford that foul at the expense of a break. How about Harden attacking the rim? Very aggressive. And the U.S. gets away with one. As Harden thought about a shot, Curry the ball fake, and the make for three. 13. Thompson in traffic, jacks one up. Anthony Davis there to clean it. Down on the turnover. And you talk about all those missed shots that turn to passes. Here's Harden from long range hitting. What a start to the second half. 10-0 run to start the third quarter. Lithuania and, Mark officially in trouble. And calling games. We talk about uh, Lithuanian royalty. No question. One of the great players ever in international play. And this guy, Clay Thompson, continues to light it up. He's got 16. You loved his comments to Mark Stein at halftime. Uh, he loved Chippy. You play Lithuania, you're going to be in a Chippy game, and they have battled. Been playing for all those folks. He tweeted out uh, saying, we have a special opportunity tonight as Kyrie Irving finishes on the slam. We have a who got hurt earlier. Kuzminskis had a great first half, just got picked. Kyrie leaves it for Davis for the jam. Right now, what USA has done to blow this wide open. Yeah, they've dominated the quarter. They came out. Been a habit of theirs to really refocus on the third quarter, coming out at halftime. Boogie Cousins, nice move. And scoring against Jonas Valanciunas. Remember that elbow he caught in the first half against Valanciunas. Johnny Flynn's contract, I think. U.S. enjoying a 22-point lead with 3.25 to go in the third. A three-pointer for James Harden. It's a bit ambiguous. Difficult. Valanciunas for three. Look up. Down court for Harden, who was scoreless at half. And how about James Harden in the third quarter spearheading? Mason Plumley on the floor. He came in when Cousins went down with four fouls. Rose missing from outside. And plays. Ready to attack toward the rim. Tipped out, but Harden has it. Against Kuzminskis. Off the dribble. James Harden continuing his outstanding third quarter. Brinovich had it taken away. Plumley again involved. Down court. Thompson for Rose on the reverse. Scoreless. We've seen now consecutive games at halftime. Uh, they've been able to blow away the competition in the third and not even have to sweat out a fourth quarter like Spain did yesterday, eventually losing. So much fire. Jeff Capel, Mike Hopkins, assistant coach from Syracuse, Adrian Griffin, assistant coach New Jersey. You talk about guys like Sabonis and Marshall Onis, the first Lithuanian to play in the NBA. Europe is the last great point guard in Lithuania and it's not a position that they developed quite well, quite frankly. They've done it through the first seven. They're in position here on this eighth and would have a chance to go through the entire tournament. Here's Irving. Great spin move in basket. Kyrie Irving showing off his array of moves here in the fourth quarter. Five minutes to go. Wrapping up a stay in Barcelona for the United States, which of course holds so much history for Team USA dating back to the dream team as Cousins scores. I had forgotten that the dream team in 1992 played Lithuania in the semifinals. Now they beat them by 51 points. Yep. But not the first time yeah. they've met in Barcelona in a semifinal. And that was some of the remnants of those guys that played on those Soviet Union teams and you see the margins so far in this tournament. By the way, the answer to the question is nobody. Nobody has. Has ever won every game by at least 20 points. The 1994 U.S. team won it by at least 15 points every game. So timeout on the floor. On Saturday Called. on ESPN3. And then the gold medal game coming up on Sunday. Fareed out to Irving. Yep, been yep. his fourth quarter. Was Harden in the third. But that bronze medal game, regardless of who they play, is particularly huge. Oh, the Manimal arriving here in the fourth quarter. Attempts, 42% were rebounded by the United States. That's an yep. astounding number. That is an excellent number. If you're in the 30% range, it's great. 42 is enormous. Rosen in the corner to Curry for three. Oh. 
And here's what Coach K's done. Yeah, you know, and not only not only the great coaching uh, record and history, but the fact that he's a West Point grad. He's, uh, he's either France self or Serbia. Irving on the fall away hits again. Led the way today with 16 points. Not bad for a guy who was scoreless at halftime. Which is kind of a microcosm of how they played. And the United States advancing to the gold medal game. There you see Marty Postius and his former college coach embracing. Healthy respect both ways. Team USA knew that Lithuania, a physical, chippy, experienced team, would give them some trouble. They did for a half. And then the explosiveness of Team USA in that third quarter, sort of a recurring theme throughout FIBA World Cup for Team USA, was the difference. So the travel day, and then uh, they'll all be at, oh, we got some uh, extracurriculars here as we come off the court. One of the Lavrinovic tins and I don't know if it was DeMarcus Cousins and now look at Coach K getting right in the middle of everything and Kenneth Fareed trying to bring Coach K away. Wow, not something we normally see at the international events. That's what happens. You know what Clay Thompson said at halftime, right? Two teams fighting for a medal. Two teams went after each other. Part of competition. So tempers running high as the U.S. and Lithuania have completed the U.S. into the gold medal game on Sunday.